Greetings everyone, this is Danny from hardtravel.com, your Royal Caribbean cruise experts. And today, I'm on board the beautiful Allure of the Seas. This particular category is an ocean view. It's one of the forward-facing kinds. Now I'm gonna take you through the room here in just a minute, but keep in mind when you're ready to book this room or any room or suite with Royal Caribbean, Celebrity or Silver Sea, make sure you do it right on hardtravel.com. You can take advantage of our interactive deck plans to pick the perfect room or suite for you, your friends, family, or group at an incredible value. Now let's tour the room. Now when you walk in the door, right to the side here, you're gonna have the bathroom. Now as we step inside, it's a really nice size for an entry level room. Now you're gonna find that you have storage up and down with the shelves, plug for a razor up above, a little bit of storage underneath here and underneath the sink. Now as I step into the shower, I'm 6'6", I'm a big guy. I fit just fine in here and that's because you have these large bowed out shower doors. I really appreciate that in lieu of a shower curtain. Now you're gonna have an adjustable shower wand up above. You have your bath amenities here that will replenish throughout, two hooks, and then you're also gonna have a nook behind for your bath amenities as well. Just outside, you'll find your temperature control, a floor to ceiling mirror here to get ready, and right around the corner, you're gonna have your closet. Now as I open that up, you're gonna have hanging storage that goes all the way across, a shelf up above, and you also have a pull down bar so you can have more hanging storage down below. Here you're gonna find shelves all the way up and down, safe, perfect size for a passport or a wallet, not quite big enough for a laptop. Now the bed is together in what they call their Royal King configuration. It does separate apart into two twins if that's your preference. In that case, the nightstand would move to the middle, that way you'd have a little bit more separation. Now either way, you've got plenty of space underneath the bed to tuck your large bags away completely. Now as we head further into the room, you're gonna find that you have a nice large sofa. Now this particular one does fold out so you can get up to four passengers in here. Make sure you check the deck plans on hardtravel.com to pick the perfect option for you. Now directly across, you're gonna find a flat panel TV. It can angle towards the bed or towards the couch. Either way, it's that perfect option so that you can watch television, stream on-demand movies, or of course you can see what's going on throughout the ship. Now you've got your mini fridge tucked underneath here, drawers for storage there. You're gonna have a large backlit mirror where you can sit and get ready. You'll have three US plugs up above, a US and a European plug down below. Now always bring extra European adapters and converters to take advantage of all the plugs in the space. And you're also gonna have your hair dryer just underneath that you can use to get ready. Now I usually bring an extra battery backup, that way I can charge it during the day, put it on the nightstand in the evening and charge my devices overnight. Now there's two more shelving units right here to the side there. Now just out front, you're gonna find a large ocean view window. Now you're gonna get the same views as the captain, though I did wanna point out at nighttime, you do need to shut the curtains. We're here in the evening filming, so I just wanted to point that out. You get some beautiful views there, but you do need to shut it just for safety in the evening. Now when you're ready to book this room or any room or suite, make sure you do it right on hardtravel.com. You can take advantage of our interactive deck plans to pick the perfect room or suite for you, your friends, family, or group at an incredible value, and get the hard travel signature service every step of the way.